Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with another tutorial. In today's DaVinci Resolve 15 tutorial, we're gonna have a look at titles. So how to do titles before your movie and during your movie and at the end as well, why not? Okay, let's get into it. Gonna go ahead and start an untitled project and now we need some media. So let me go ahead and import some media. The way I'm gonna do it is I'm gonna click on the media button down here at the bottom. Then I'm gonna go find my media. It's going to ask you if you want to change your clip to match the project settings. For this example, I'm going to say don't change. But I will say that you should have your project settings set to uh, what your video clips are going to be, whether it's 30 frames per second, 60 frames, or 20 frame, 24 frames per second, and the size, of course, 1080p, 4K, etc. Okay. Once you got your media down here, let's go to the editing button here. And what I'm going to do is drag this clip into the timeline here. DaVinci is going to go ahead and create two tracks for us, uh, an audio and a video. What I'm going to do is create two more video tracks, and I'll show you why. So right click here, add track, right click here, add track. Okay, next we're going to add the text. I want to add a little bit to the beginning, so I'm going to drag the clip a little bit to the right to give us some space here. And next we're going to go to the effects library. Mine's currently showing, but it might not be. So if it isn't, go ahead and just click effects library. And I just want regular old text. So what I'm going to do is click and grab and I'm going to drag it to the second video track here in the timeline. Okay, now we have a title here. So what I'll do is I'll butt this thing right up against it and we're going to go ahead and do a quick play. So right now it, it says title. So let's hit play. And then it's going to go into the video. Okay, but we want to change that, of course. So we're going to click to highlight it. And you can do two things here. You can double click, which I'll do now. And that's going to open up the inspector here. Let me close that again. Or you can highlight it and click inspector. Right now, inspector is only showing a little portion of itself. But if you want to see the full inspector, click on this down arrow here. Okay. So what we're going to do now is actually edit the title. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's just make it title. T-I-T-L-E. Let's change the font. We're going to go ahead and go to impact or something like that. Uh, we're going to change the color to, mm, uh, let's do some fluorescent color like that. You can change the size if you'd like. So we'll make it plenty big so you can see it. And one more thing I want to do to it. You can also change the line spacing if you'd like, where you want it to be. And the tracking, how far apart, how close, etc. Oh wait, I'm a little bit off of my line spacing here. Good enough. But most importantly for me, I like to put a little outline around and that's where you're gonna use this stroke here. So let's change the color to something we can actually see. Uh, green, I don't know, orange, I don't know, whatever. <laughs> Just pick whatever color. I might not do this in real life, but there we go. So we'll put a little, little uh, stroke around it, a little outline. And for that, that's good enough. We'll call it that. Again, maybe it's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle colors, but I don't know if I'd use it in my project, but just for an example. Okay, to close the inspector, just go ahead and click on this button here. All right, now we have a title before our movie. So I'll hit play. And looks like it's probably a little bit too long, about five seconds. So. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and stop. So what we wanna do is um, we can customize this just a little bit. So I'll do a little fade in by using the tool here in the left corner and do a little fade out using the other one. And I also wanna shorten it. Let's shorten this bugger just a little. Okay, now let's play it again. So we add a little fade at the beginning and the end. Okay, so fades in, that's gonna fade out. Okay, and you'll notice that we've, we haven't crossed the threshold here, we're still in a separate area we haven't overlapped. So watch what happens when you make it overlap. So I'm gonna drag this clip just a little bit overlapping and let's watch again. Alrighty, we're gonna go ahead and push play. And you'll notice as soon as it overlaps, we get the title with a transparent background over the video. And actually, let me make this longer so you can kind of see. Ready, I'll go ahead and play. So we're overlapping here, yeah? You'll notice the background is transparent with the title. Away from the okay. I'll go ahead and stop that, but let's bring this back to where we had it. Okay, and I might want to add a little teeny fade here as well. I can overlap just a tad. Let's see how that looks. All right, title fades. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I like that. 
Okay, so we've added a title before the movie without an overlap, before the movie with an overlap, and now let's just add a title right in the middle of, of somewhere. So let's add a middle lower third. So let's go ahead and grab one of these. You'll notice when I put it there, here, let's make this bigger so you can see it. There we go. You'll notice when I put it there, the actual lower third appears. So again, double click here or click and highlight and push the inspector button here. And you'll notice since the lower third has two titles, basically, we have two areas. So let's go ahead and do that. The shark attack. He wasn't expecting that. That uh, LOL. LOL. Okay. So again, I'm not a fan of these fonts right here. So let's go ahead and change the fonts to something different. Uh, scripts. Yeah, it's okay. Let's do a little bit bigger. Whoa, too big. Let's do bold. I need bold. Okay. In the bottom one, we'll do the same kind of script. And we'll be for the. I'll make it bold too as well. Ah, for now, we'll leave the color the way it is. We'll do a little fade in, a little fade out. So let's watch it real quick. Let me go ahead and close the inspector. Don't knock the loop. Okay. <laughs> so the positioning for me, I think it's a little bit too high. So I want to lower it down. So I'm going to hit the positioning tool here. And I'm going to move my lower thirds. You know, you don't have to have them in the center. You can have them pretty much anywhere you want. You can even rotate them a little bit. So, you know. Let's just mess around here. He wasn't expecting that. Okay, we'll go ahead and click that button again to take off the tools. All right, let's have a quick watch. Don't knock the loop. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Again, with video editing or any kind of creative endeavor, it's pretty much up to you and your creativity. Okay, and the last thing I wanna show you is kind of a scrolling title. So over here in your titles, go ahead and grab this scroll here. We're gonna drag it to the end of the video clip. You can keep it in the same clip or you can put it in another track if you'd like. It's kind of all up to you. To me, if I'm getting really complicated, I'll add more tracks. If I wanna keep it simple, I'll start doing stuff in like one, two, maybe three tracks max. But after a while, it just gets all out of control. So I'm a, I'm a simple editor, let's just say. All right, so we have our scroll title here and that's what it's gonna do. So let's go ahead and double click on it and get to the inspector. We're gonna go ahead and say the end. And we'll change the font to, and we'll go ahead and change the font to impact, why not? See what it looks like. Make it a little bit bigger. Yeah, I think that should be okay. All right, let's go ahead and have a look. Playing it toward the end, and then it cuts to the end. Again, if you want to make it a little bit less abrupt, you can add a little bit of a fade in your outro, and maybe a fade in on the actual title itself. So let's see what that actually looks like. Yeah, not bad, not bad. And again, as we mentioned early, if there's any overlap whatsoever, we're gonna see that title on the trans as a transparency over top of the movie itself. All right, let's take out that fade. We'll take out this fade. Make it a little bit more pronounced. Here we go. I think we need more. I think we need more. There we go. All right, let's take a look now. Dun dun. So there you go. That's pretty much how you do titles, basic titles. I don't want to get very complex. I mean, these tutorials are geared for people who are doing YouTube videos. We're not trying to do any Hollywood production or anything. As usual, I want to thank everybody for watching and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace and aloha.